Borak Thung, Earthlets, and welcome to the 2080 YouTube channel. I'm here with Keith Richardson, our graphic Hello. novels editor. Now, it's been a little while since we've brought you the forthcoming thrills from uh, the House of Tharg, so we thought we'd uh, let you know about what's coming up for what is really shaping up to be a, a, a summer of uh, some great graphic novels, isn't it, Keith? One of the best. Yeah. <laughs> One of the best, yeah. So I say so myself. Easy. Yeah, brilliant. Um, well, you know what? We're, go we're going to start off with, um, with a biggie. Okay. Okay, now. Literally. Oh, yeah, literally. The biggie. Now, let's get it right away up, Mike. Um, this is uh, the Vox for the Zenith uh, Apex Edition. Now, Keith, tell us a little bit, before I take it out and we have a good look, yeah. tell me a little bit about the Apex Edition. Uh, it all came about when we were at um, the British Library. There was a comics exhibition last year. Mm. And um, having a look around, it, brilliant exhibition. But um, I noticed a page of Zenith there. I just basically wondered if Steve had any more. So I got in contact and he had all of Phase 1. Right. So uh, we thought straight away, ideal time to kind of collect all that up. If he would let us have those pages and get out a nice big Apex edition. I mean, that's 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 quite a thing for for an artist to keep all their exactly. original artwork. It's from, such such a rarity. Yeah, yeah, and, and, rarity. On, and on a strip like Zenith as well. I'm going to uh, take this out of its box. Now, um, there's been a bit of a delay on the shipping of these, so uh, those of you who have pre-ordered uh, this book uh, will now be getting it in August. But it is truly worth the wait because it is a thing of beauty. Let's pop that down there. there so uh, this is uh, the Phase 1 Apex Edition. Now, uh, what is an Apex Edition? Well, it's uh, like the artist editions uh, that you get in, uh, in the States, and it is quite literally the original artwork photographed, not scanned, not cleaned up, photographed as it is, so you get to see um, all the little sort of uh, fading speech bubbles, all the replaced um, panels. If there was any notes on the original art, they'd be yeah. there as well. Yeah, um, and there's one or two pages, he said, where um, Steve has, oh, there we go, uh, Steve has made little notes about uh, about the history behind uh, particular pages. I mean, I, just just off the bat, on this uh, this page, you can see how Steve has replaced one of the panels on there, which is just, I mean, if, if, you, if you're a lover of good artwork or, or, or comic books or both, or uh, this, this, this is just a, a wonderful, wonderful uh, object, a, a piece of art. It speaks um, for itself. Look yeah. At this, look at this artwork. It's absolutely, just amazing. Absolutely. And it's one of the best stories to ever appear in 2000 AD. So, yeah. you know, unless you live in a very tiny caravan... This is a must-buy. <laughs> I mean, one thing that this does uh, for me is really uh, solidifies my respect for letterers. Oh yeah. Because this is all hand-lettered. This isn't uh, uh, this isn't digitally done. This is somebody physically sitting there and drawing out each individual letter, which uh, is is just stunning, stunning work. Um, now, this this is currently available for free pre-order on our website. That's correct at uh, www.2080online.com um, and will be uh, shipping in August. Um, moving swiftly on, we have, uh, I mean, this is a, another beautiful little hardback, a bit smaller scale, I'm afraid, uh, but this is Dark Justice uh, by John Wagner and Greg Staples. Tell us a bit about this, Keith. Well, the, the, the Dark Judges haven't really appeared for quite some time. I mean, they, they've been in Day of Chaos, but yeah. altogether, the four of them, it, it's been over 10 years easily. Um, and yeah, this this is basically Greg Staples got this going, uh, got John really passionate about the Dark Judges again. I think he lost a little bit of it for a while. Yeah. But Greg's got a passion for the Dark Judges. He loves drawing them. He's did one other story with the Dark Judges in, Dead Reckoning, uh, yes, some yeah. years ago. Yeah. And he just wanted to tackle them again. And this is brilliant. It, it's, you know, it's aliens meets Friday the 13th in space. It's, it's amazing. Yeah. I mean, if, if, I Every mean, the, page looks gorgeous. This, this, yeah, the story alone uh, is, is, is worth it. But when, when you get just absolutely amazing, uh, fully painted up, I mean, this took him yeah. two years, two to, years to, 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 to paint, which uh, it, it's is the definition of a passion project right here. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's all we've got time for uh, on this little snippet. Thanks very much to Keith for uh, joining us to talk about our forthcoming graphic novel releases. Stay tuned to the 2080 YouTube channel for more about the amazing summer of thrills that we have for you. Splendid Verthrig.